let's see, his pasture is a slight downgrade. I don't know, what is that? Maybe like five degree, 10 degree kind of slope. It all slopes down to down there. And it's kind of like the whole thing. It kind of comes up and up and up and it's more flat up there in that corner. And up there is kind of flat. But all of this has a nice slow slant down. Now Paul said he did just have all of those sheep or goats or whatever it was he said he had out here recently. So they ate down a lot of this. Here's his pasture. Nothing really to, I don't know, show. There you go, I guess. Let's go out to the pasture, shall we? See if we can get... Oh, we can. Okay, so let's get in the pasture a bit. So maybe this will give you a better idea of the grade. You can see it all just kind of rolls down from here. One of the things that I noticed about the pasture here at Paul's is over by the wood pile, if you look at about throwing distance, you see all of this bark. So it looks like he just throws it out here into the pasture and lets it do its thing. And here is a little bit of the firewood that Paul has. And then, there's more. <laughs> okay, so some of you wanted me to spend time on the pasture fence as well. So, here's what we got. Um, just looks like little Z kind of formation here to this pole for the corner. And maybe that's, I guess, an N. Um, big wire fence kneeled in around it all the way down to the ground. And that's it. Now we have this pole here, I guess, maybe to help keep it sturdy, straight. You can see here that all of the sheep or whatever was in there just recently have been rubbing up against the fence here and you can see their wool stretched out along the fence line. Back to the fence. So, let's come up to a gate, see all of the um, wool from the sheep against this fence. Let's come up here. Now when we get to a gate, we have this little support beam right here. And here we have just, uh, looks like a hanger wire maybe, wrapped around there. There's I guess the old block. You 
hinges for you to look at. And again, we have just a beam. Here, that looks like it's just to kind of keep it steady. And fencing wrapped around the poles here. Just like a log to give it some more support. We do have some barbed wire on this fence too. And you can see here, he's probably going to have to support this up soon. It's starting to fall. Looks like it uh, broke down there. Back to some fence line. Looks like here he has a pole on one side and a pole on the other side, and then just kneel them together, going down this whole side here. Well, that is the pasture and the fence for the pasture.